Okay, YouTube, welcome back to Fent Noobs, World of Tanks with the Flying Fent. This is episode number 99, and this is Fury. I did it. It was uh, 30 bucks Canadian, roughly, uh, after the conversion rate, and I was like, you know what? Deal's on for 60 days, but screw it. It's collectible. I want it. So I went ahead and did it. I purchased the Fury tank. I also got... Uh... uh 2600 gold I want to say. I had 300 right now I'm with 2900 so 2600 gold with that purchase as well but uh, check it out the Fury tank. Oh what a beautiful beast Sherman Firefly. Outstanding uh, one thing I did notice they're calling him Corporal Norman Ellison over here the radio operator uh, in the movie he's private Norman Ellison and uh, he's an assistant driver so that's interesting I believe Hmm. Yeah, I guess it makes sense to make him a radio operator, but they did call him the assistant driver in the movie, and uh, he did no radio operating at all. Not even a little bit. Uh, but there you go. Like I said, I'm not ready for tier 6, so I'm not really going to touch this bad boy until I am, but oh, what a beautiful machine, isn't it? Look at all the detail on it. little USA there on the side. Uh... 2 Delta, 66 Delta, I remember that from the movie as well. There was one scene where he had a bit of a close-up on it. I remember that uh, that, uh, that absolutely, the 2 Delta, 66 Delta. Uh, the, the logs, I remember those from the movie as well. Well detailed, very well detailed. Very impressed with that. I wouldn't mind actually getting like a collectible model of the Fury. That would be pretty cool too. Uh, but anyways, yeah, not ready for it. So let's go ahead with our, not our M3 Lee, the T18. That's what I want. And let's hop into battle with our T18. Oh, it's a beautiful looking tank, that, uh, uh the Fury tank. Mm -mm. Outstanding. Yeah, that's, I mean, when you think about it, for the amount of time I've already put into this game, I've already gotten more out of it than I do in game, in, on games that I spend 50 bucks on, right? So 30 bucks, a small price to pay for uh, something I enjoy this much. I'm perfectly happy to uh, support World of Tanks with that. And having that extra gold is nice too, the 2600 gold. I have no idea what I'll spend it on, but it's nice to have it there. Uh, the other thing is I freed up a garage slot to make sure I had room for the Fury, but it actually comes with a garage slot, which is a nice touch, you know? I, that's, that's very nice. If you want to collect vehicles, you can, because they just give you a, a free slot every time you buy one. I think that's reasonable. So I was very let's pleased with that as well. Yeah, let's get the show on the road. Knock over that uh, telephone pole right onto the Panzer II. Oh, 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 thanks for the nudge. Oh, and then you're going to go that way. You're a clown. Why didn't you just go up the right side then? There's no doubt in my mind that you, sir, are a clown. Wow, look at this artillery. He's not afraid to move up. Whoop. Can I see this clown? I can. Enemy armor is hit. That wasn't even close. Move up a little bit now. Whoop. Yeah, you probably don't want to sit in one place for too long there, artillery, like you did. Well, no offense, but I don't really find the hills all that important. So if you lose on the hill, I mean, there's worse that can happen, you know? Oh, he's coming out. You gonna come play there, medium two? You will. Oh, he has help from somewhere because his shot missed me. Or it ricocheted off the ground. I suppose that's a possibility. Uh, but he is now dead. Yeah, I was trying to get in behind here to get some cover. There we go. Alright, now you guys hold down that flank for me, please. Or we be screwed. No, I was still sticking out and didn't gain anything for that. I got no problem sticking out if I'm going to get something for it, you know? And I bet it was the T-57 that was putting rounds into me. But now he's a little busy. Can't see him, he's kind of ran around the corner. This 
so we might as well move up here. Get some flanking shots on people. Well, they have two artillery. Oh, so did we. <laughs> Sorry, artillery. I'm coming. I'm going to take hit before I can dish any out, I think. Oh, maybe not. Well, this looks like it's going to be a pretty clear victory for us. I got one guy left and he's hiding in the corner. Uh, I won't have done much. Which is always unfortunate. But, um... I mean, what can you do? you got to be in the right place, right? I played this a little bit safer and uh, paid the price with uh, not doing anything. There you go. 300 experience for doing nothing. It's not quite enough. Oh, it is enough. T-82 unlocked. Well, now I'm really glad I didn't buy that gun upgrade. Uh, so T-18, you are done as well. Oh, uh, tank destroyer crew. American tank destroyer. Yeah, we'll keep them. Send to barracks. Uh, what's next on the list? All right. Our French connection. Here we go. D1. The big... Wait a minute. D1? Does that make sense? Didn't we... Oh, the H35. Right. The D1 we sold. I was going to say, didn't we unlock the, D, the D2? Which would have been through the D1, I would assume? And the answer is yes. Yes, we did. And yes, it is. Which is good, because it was horribly slow. This is a little bit quicker, this H35. I'm much happier in this bad boy. Okay, um, I always get into the skirmishes in the buildings here, and that's kind of nice. The buildings give you lots of cover. It all comes down to how your team does, though. If your team kind of gets defeated pretty badly in through the buildings, then um, it's not much you can do. Let's go! I really like those. Uh, I really like the look of Panzer tanks. Just like I really like the looks of Stooks. Something about German tanks, it just looks so good. They mentioned the start of fear as well, right? But um, much more advanced than anything the Allies had as well. Uh, at least at the at the opening of the uh, of the war. Okay, sure. You want to? park right in front of someone else's gun there cruiser 4 that seems reasonable I'm just giving a hard time I realize he didn't know I was there he's not like that uh, captain catch up or whatever it was Pines Guderian or whatever who very clearly saw people there and just decided to saunter up beside them anyway waiting for these guys to expose themselves in some meaningful way Looks like they're advancing. Oh, Panzer 1C. Oh, you are brave. I would not have done that. Knowing that they're all just sitting right in back here. Oh, they're coming up from behind us. We're about to get flanked. Enemy armor is hit. There we go. Some damage. That one didn't go through. Enemy armor is damaged. And then a miss there. Fine. There's enough of our guys back there that I'm not worried about them capping. I'm just worried about them advancing and taking us, taking me from behind. But so far, it looks like they're holding out. Oh no, they are totally not. We are totally gonna die. They've killed nine and we've killed three. They've killed eleven and we've killed three. I see you coming there, Panzer. Uh, be ready for them to flank from the left here. See that they're getting ready for that. We're going to lose this, and it's going to be one of my better fights in a while. There's more coming. They see me locked down. Yeah, game over. Second last tank in the fight. 
I did my part, you know. I locked down what I could. Got this M3 Stewart on the run. He's not gonna last long. Might as well tough it out and watch him go down. Yep. Yep. Well, you tried, bud. You made a good run of it. Uh, oh, what did I get there? Sharpshooter and a fire for effect. Only 133 experience. That's kind of sad. Up to 963. You know what? I'm going to hop right in again with the H35 because, you know, one good battle with our uh, times two experience and um, we could do it. We could pull ahead. That best job I ever had. That's cool. That's cool. I can assume now the developers must have had uh, a preview of uh, Fury for quite some time to be able to get the detailed models that they have and little snippets of trivia. Which, hey, good marketing for the Fury people, right? I mean, why wouldn't they give a preview copy to World of Tanks? Uh, and, you know, they pro they might, well, I shouldn't say, I was going to say they probably threw some money, but uh, they may not have, right? It might have been like a... No, I bet they did. They must have thrown money at, uh, at Wargaming. Is that the, that's the same guy in the last fight? Move out! You guys want to turn around, do you? All right, let me sneak through you. Oh, gee. Oh, <laughs> I almost drove in everybody. Wow, who's doing all the shooting? Holy smokes. Who are you shooting at? There's nobody to hit. Calm your tits, buddy. So we're making a good rush here for the cap. Uh, it looks like they are really blitzing hill, which I don't know if that's going to help them. Can they see the cap circle from the hill? Is that a thing? Our artillery is a sitting duck because we don't really have anybody up there. Yeah, they're just they're driving right by them. I don't even know what they're shooting at them. I wish this tank was faster. All right, now our artillery is dead. So they're winning in the kills category. That cruiser one's in a good spot. He's got good cover from the left. I'm going to move up there and join them. I know there are people coming around from behind us, but we should be able to keep an eye on them. It's only these guys here that are advancing that uh, may cause us some trouble. No, like, Vic done. medium was stuck behind a truck. We got rid of the truck. Now can we see him? I don't think we can. He's advancing though. Now we can see him, but that was a big miss. They got artillery. I don't know what kind of angle that artillery has though. I don't know if they can get to me from there. All right. What about this guy over here? Can I see this guy? Is this a better shot? Yes.
He's going around the building now. That's right, we're still racking up the cap points. Here comes this T60. That one bounced. Oh, and of course I can't penetrate him. That's bad news. Luckily my cohort seems able to penetrate. We didn't even scratch them. We didn't even scratch them. Well, they just reset my cap. It's unfortunate. Nobody cares about the hill. You can't get us. Oh, because I've got one tank left. Uh, no, it's artillery back there. Oh, well. I'm just going to... I think that guy missed my point. I realized he wasn't telling me to go to the hill. I was just wondering why anyone cared about the hill. Uh, anyways, we only needed like 100 experience and we obviously got it there. So bang, AMX 38 unlocked. So there's the H35 done. Uh, French light, yes. And I did want to keep this crew because I kept only the whatever. It's on a discount, I don't care. Uh, Renault FTAC, ooh. But we're kind of at time here. Um, let's just uh, spend the rest of this video reviewing. We're done uh, China, we're done Japan. I'm sorry, we're done Japan, we're done China. Uh, we're done Russia except artillery. We're done France except artillery and the FTAC, which we still have and we're working on. How much more do we need? Uh, oh, look at this, I have guns I can unlock. Why didn't I do this? I have to unlock that gun anyway. Uh, so I need another... Why is it telling me my experience? Oh, I have none, probably, I bet. Yeah, look at that. I used a whole bunch of free experience. Oops. Uh, I need 1750, so that's going to take a while. But let's just take a look here. This is 50 and 20. 50 and 20. Is it better rate of fire? 35.29. No. So why would I get that one? Much slower. Uh, and what about this one? 50 and 20. Uh, I think I want this one. 1.9 aim time. So it's slower to aim. The average damage is significantly higher. The penetration is slightly higher. I want this one. So there we go. Let's go ahead and get our ammunition. All right, and then we'll go back to the tech tree here. Uh, so working on the FTAC. Uh, then we have, I didn't do anything in the German or anything in the British because I jumped straight to American. And uh, we are, done with American? I can sell the M2 light, in fact. Uh, do I want to keep the crew from it? It's a good question. Yes, I do. So let's sell. We will keep the crew. So does that mean we were done for American? I don't remember. We are done for American. Right, finish the T-18, finish the M2 light. Wow. That's pretty uh, pretty fantastic. Uh, so we have British left, we have German left, and we have the FTAC, and that's it. Wow, I'm very, I'm really looking forward to getting, you know, getting into some of these German tanks. I'm also really looking forward to getting into some of these British tanks. And I've been thinking I probably will do, I said, oh, I'm not going to do the same thing for Tier 3. I might, if I keep if I keep struggling like I was before in my tier fours, I might just uh, go ahead and play some tier threes. I don't know if I'll play all of them like I did with the tier two, but I'll probably play some of them. 
Uh, now, the only other thing I wanted to check out was the research tree in the Fury. Oh, and look at that, it's fully unlocked. No research, more credits for each battle, elite status. Uh, a battle experience earned to free experience from the first battle. Wow. Accelerated crew training available from the first battle. Wow. So premium vehicles, pretty cool, pretty cool stuff. Oh, such a cool looking tank too. Like it looks like a tank, you know, like the M3 Lee to me, like that doesn't really look like it. It looks, I don't know, it looks weird. You know, and even some of the, like this here, I mean, that looks like a tank, you know? Like even this, like it has a turret and tracks, but other than that, like what's with the little bulbous things and, you know? But I mean, you look at the, at the Shermans and they just look like a stereotypical tank, you know? Just like a lot of the German, uh, and that's one of the reasons I like the German tanks. They kind of look like stereotypical tanks. You know, when we work, if you, especially if you start looking at like the Stugs and stuff, which of course I can't. Oh, I can't open. Like they just they just look like a, a tank destroyer. You know, to me that's like the look. That's how they should look. Uh, so there you go. Good times, good times indeed. Uh, yeah, so we got to go ahead and work on the tier two Germans. As I said, the tier two British. We're done with the American. Uh, done with the American stuff. I might grab an M3 Stewart. Because it's fast and it looks like it would be fun to play with. Uh, so I might grab an M3 Stuart. And uh, that would allow us to continue working on uh, the... Nope. Where do they keep events now? Oh, it's i got to go back to the garage to see them. Uh, yeah, there's a, an event going on right now. I wonder how long it's going for where you got to kill German tanks. Uh, hunt, not hunt the pros. Not the leopard. What? What is this? Destroy vehicles of the nation, Germany. Oh, you have to kill 10 German vehicles in one day. Ooh. Ooh, I see. Oh, but I could do that in the steward. 10 German vehicles in one day. That would be tricky. German onslaught. Yeah, you gotta kill American vehicles. Again, 10 in one day. Uh, this here has also killed German vehicles. Reset every day. Interesting. Okay. Uh, well, I'll be honest, a lot of that is not going to get done. It's <laughs> just, you know, not even something I can really work on. Is this a per day thing? Number of vehicles... M3 Leaf, Fury DWT, T28. What is this? Destruction 1 until November 1st. I don't understand. I just have to kill five... I haven't killed five vehicles since I got my M3 Lee and my DW2 and my T28, I haven't killed five vehicles. Oh, I haven't killed five vehicles in those since this mission began, not necessarily since I've had them. Right, because they're tier four or higher. Or maybe that is all I've killed. Actually, what is this, kill enemy vehicles too? This says I've killed 11, this says I've killed one. Oh, probably because I finished this, right? I finished it and it starts counting over. So kill 10, if you look, I've completed it once, number of mission completions. I completed it once and I'm back at one. The five I've completed twice and I'm back at one. I understand. Now I get it. All right, good times. Well, we've done pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, so we have our Renault to work on. And you know what? I might as well get some stuff in my garage, right? So let's hope, hop into our tech tree here. Uh, working on France, we finished America. So let's go ahead and buy some German vehicles. What would I like to play with? The Panzer 1, I believe I have I have not done it. So let's go ahead and buy the Panzer 1. I will purchase them without a crew, and if I need them, I'll get the crew. Uh, let's get the Panzer 35T without a crew. And let's get the Panzer Jaeger 1 without a crew. Uh, I probably, I can almost guarantee you I need a crew. Let's get a uh, rapid train crew. I have the I have the money in the in the account to get a better crew, but I think for tier two I'm not gonna bother with that. I will hang on to them. Uh, let's do the crew first. Do I have? I did. Look at that. Commander light tank. Is this a light tank? It is. This is also a light tank. Which one would I rather have the crew in? I think I'd rather have them in this one. This will be my experienced good crew. You, what? Oh, the thing scrolled. That's what happened. You will have a uh, scrub crew. 
Here we go. All right. Uh, so, first tank I bought was this one. Service, repair, resupply, resupply. And it was first aid kit, fire extinguisher, and small repair. We'll accept all of that. So the Panzer 35T is ready for battle. The Panzer 1, repair, resupply, resupply. First aid, repair, and fire extinguisher. It is ready for battle. And then our Panzer Jaeger, repair, resupply, resupply. First aid, repair, and fire extinguisher, accept. Now that one's ready for battle. So another thing we have to do is go ahead and update our crew. Uh, retrain. Rapid, yep, there we go. So we are ready for battle, yeah. Um, oh, I'm gonna love it. I'm gonna love these German tanks. But uh, the big focus, I think, will be to hurry up and knock out that Renault FTAC. That'll be my, my primary mover and shaker until it's done, because then we can knock French out of the uh, out of the equation as well, right? It will be done. Uh, German, we have all the German tanks I'm going to play now. I'm obviously not going to be doing German artillery. Uh, at least not... I have no intention of doing it ever, but for now at least, I'm, I'm definitely not going to be touching it. And once we unlock some of those, we've only got what? One, two, three. We've only got three British tanks to unlock. Uh, and then maybe we can try some more of these Tier 4 matches with our uh, M3 Lee and our Duck Bruck 2 and all that type of stuff. Uh, but that'll be in a future episode. For now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Ah, oh, what a beautiful tank. It's all about the logs.